So from urbanised, highly residential catchment areas, like here in Darabin, we've got litter, unfortunately. Broken down products of litter. Chemical pollutants, believe it or not. Things that drip onto our catchment area from our cars. We're using even fertilisers at higher rates than even farmers are. And these flow into our drains and into our creeks and waterways, smothering our waterways and eventually Port Phillip Bay and the sea with things it can't cope with. So constructed wetland systems can break down even some of the most nasty pollutants. They are the kidneys of the land. My name is George Paris. I'm the Sanctuary Ranger with the Latrobe University's Wildlife Sanctuary. Latrobe's founders always had the vision of having a, an outdoor laboratory a place for learning and research. In 1972, they applied what was known then about treating water, constructing a series of ponds to treat the water biologically, improve the water quality, but also the ponds themselves became important wetland habitat for birds, amphibians, and in time, fish, and a whole lot of other aquatic organisms. And the improvement of water quality before the water meets the sea again. My interest in this area started with a fascination with fishing. Became a uni student and a volunteer here in the early 80s. Plants, birds, animals, frogs, fish, water, they're all linked. And here was one real practical opportunity to stop moaning and getting depressed about all the environmental bad things going on. So if we're gonna do something about the environment, we've got to start locally and we've got to employ what we already know about nature and science into some practical repair program. So that's what I like about this project. 